Hi, Kelly here. So yesterday I killed all of the shitty characters and uh, today I was making new ones. New shitty characters. So, one of each, of course. Um, I um, have some uh, numbers of the roles and uh, after that there's some uh, footage of uh, me sitting in the train. Yay! Okay, so here we have the staff classes. Necromancer, Wizard, and Mystic. Uh, got a um, decent roll on the Necro there for HP. Four pots. Pretty nice. Uh, the Mystic MP roll is fairly negative, but that doesn't really matter. Uh, you can see I I uh, took the brush tool there to uh, mark the ones that I was not planning on putting up. Um, Man on the necro. Well, I'm not going to be spamming the skull. There's never any need to do that. Uh, vitality, of course, you don't need that either because of the heal. And you don't use the skull very often, so wisdom. Uh, who cares? Uh, the wizard, you could argue that it doesn't need the wisdom or MP either, but it's a wizard. Come on. And uh, the mystic, um, well, screw the mystic. It sucks. I wouldn't even want to pot it up, but I'm going to do it anyway. Here we have the daggers. Trickster Assassin Rogue. Um, pretty bad roll on the Assassin, but yeah, I don't really care. I can pot that up. Normally you would probably re-roll that, but yeah. Uh, the Rogue, I'm not planning to pot, pot up the mana and wisdom because of the pet. The cloak uses 100 mana and re regens in the 6 or 6.5 six seconds that you uh, can't use the cloak. For. Uh, I put two pots in there so that it has 200 MP flat so that I can use uh, a uh, what's it called? The ring prop thing that increases your speed. I don't know. It reduces your mana by 100, so you still have 100 mana so you can use your uh, plane walker. Here we have the ever so amazing bows and the ninja. Uh, uh, very average rolls there. Um, I'm not planning to pot up the uh, MP on any of them, uh, the ninja, because um, it doesn't, you don't really shoot your star or whatever very often, at least I don't, I never use it. I only use it for the speedy boost, so the pet makes up for that, and the wisdom isn't needed either, because you can't spend the mana. Um, Huntress, well I don't use the trap at all, so I don't care. Uh, Archer, you can't permistun so you don't need the extra MP. What are you gonna do? Double stun him? No, not stun. Par paralyze. You can't double paralyze someone. Uh, the wisdom. I'm not sure if that's needed or not. I'll have to check. And, uh, yeah. The amazing swords, of course. Paladin, warrior, knight. Bit minus on the HP on the, on the warrior, plus on the knight. Uh, not potting mana and wisdom on the warrior and paladin. Um, Paladin seal costs what a hundred or something I think the Oreo, uh, and you can't use it more than every three seconds, four seconds or something, so there's no need for um, anything else. Just put in a little bit to get the ring pop there. Um, the warrior, yeah, the jug is like ninety I think, so you don't need it. Need to put in anything to use the ring pop there, and you can't use the helmet as often as you'd like either. There's really no point. Uh, the stunning, however, does require some mana. And of course the ever so useless ones. Um, very average rolls here. Um, not putting Vitalia on the priest, which it gets healed by the path and the the tome of course. So yeah, not really uh, necessary to put that up. Otherwise I'll just put everything up I think, yeah. And so here is the total. Uh, doesn't look that bad. Very low mana and uh, wisdom. So that's good. Uh, it'll take a while, but shouldn't take too long, I don't think. So it'll be interesting to see how fast it progresses. Depends entirely on how much I play, I suppose, but yeah. So uh, a little bit of gameplay. Me sitting in a train, very boring, leveling up and hopefully some music. Maybe I can find something. Enjoy, and uh, see you next time.